Hi, I'm Andy Mulholland with the Handy Andy Real Estate Experts here in Rochester, Minnesota, and welcome to our video blog. Today, we're going to be discussing the difference between assessed value of a property, appraised value, and market value. There are three, there are three, three very different things, and so we want to talk about what those things are. First, let's start by pointing you to a couple links on our video blog here. The first one is a home valuation tool where you can put in the address of your property and it'll give you a, an idea of what it might be worth. The second link is a home search tool where you'll be able to search for every listing from every company here in Southern Minnesota and it's updated every single day. All right, so now to the topic that we want to discuss, which is the difference between the assessed value, the appraised value, and market value of your property, okay? Assessed value is this. It's what the government is going to tax you on, the value that they're going to tax you on, okay? So you'll get a statement in the mail that says, here's what we're assessing your value at, and you pay a portion of that, a percentage of that value in taxes, okay? The next one is appraised value. An appraised value is what an appraiser thinks your home is worth. Now keep in mind, the appraiser is not buying it, right? And keep in mind, every appraiser will give different values for different things within your home or on your property. For example, the view or the location or the type of siding you have or you know, the finishes inside the home. Those are all things that the appraiser takes into consideration and gives their opinion of value. But keep in mind, it's not market value. So what is market value? Market value is what a buyer is willing to pay for it in today's market. So what is it actually worth? So that's the difference between assessed value, what the government thinks it's worth and what they're going to tax you on, what appraised value is, what an appraiser thinks it's worth, and then ultimately the most important one that every seller should be concerned about, which is what is market value? What is a buyer actually going to pay for in today's market? A couple things that will determine market value is supply and demand. We watch what's called the absorption rates or how many months worth of inventory you will have for your type of home, location, those things. Um, so we watch that very closely. It's very simple. The more demand there is and the lower the supply, the higher the market value. The more supply and the lower demand, the lower the market value. And so we watch those things very closely. When you work with an agent, they're going to help you determine a pricing strategy based on all that information. But those are the differences between the three. If you need any more information, you can always reach out to us by calling us at the office at 507-258-5850 or as always online at handyandysold.com. Thanks for watching.